Hello, I'm Daniel, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Cape Town, South Africa. Today, I'll show you how to create a basic Route 53 health check to monitor a public endpoint, such as a website. Let's get started. After logging into the AWS Management Console, navigate to the Route 53 console. Then, select Health Checks. Select Create Health Check. In the new screen, complete these fields. For name, enter a name to identify the health check with. Next is selecting what to monitor. Route 53 can monitor a public endpoint, the status of one or more other Route 53 health checks, or the state of a CloudWatch alarm that might be configured in your account. For additional information on these options, have a look at the AWS documentation that's linked in the description. As we are going to monitor public endpoint, select endpoint. Route 53 can identify the endpoint location on the internet using either the IP address or the domain name. I know the name of my website is not going to change, so I'll select the domain name. The caveat here is that the health check will pass only as long as the domain name resolves with DNS. So make sure that the DNS entry is in place before setting up the health check. Route 53 might check the response of the endpoint on either TCP, HTTP or HTTPS. It's a best practice to select a check that mimics the way that your end users should be connecting to your application. If you have a web application, then HTTPS should be preferred over HTTP. If you don't have a web application, then use a TCP-based check. For details on how each of these checks validate that your endpoint is available, more information can be found in the AWS documentation. My website responds to HTTPS requests, so I'll select HTTPS. For the domain name, enter the domain name of the website or service to monitor. The port is automatically configured to 443, which is the conventional TCP port for HTTPS. If you have a custom listener port, make sure to specify it here. You can also choose a path if you want Route 53 to request a specific file path. For this example, I'll leave it blank. Now select Next. On this page, you can configure an alarm notification if the Route 53 health check fails. Because I want to be notified when a website or service is offline, I'll select Yes. An existing Amazon SNS topic can be used, but I'm going to create a new one for this alarm. For topic name, enter the descriptive name to identify the SNS topic. I'll call this one Website Offline. And then add an email address that should receive the notification. If this is a new topic, remember to look for a confirmation email to subscribe the email address to notifications. Then select Create Health Check. After a short while, the health check status changes to healthy. I'll refresh the health check data to view the latest status. Route 53 health checks can also be applied to any Route 53 resource record that's not using simple routing, but health checks are especially useful when alternative endpoints are available for entry, such as when using failover, latency-based or multi-value routing policies. This makes sure that only LVL endpoint IPs are supplied to your customer devices. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.